think, so we talked a bit earlier about, um, I guess, the open environment, the nature of being on the water and in the ocean. Um, and then we just talked about before then about, you know, whenever you've gone into an event, you just give it a given it a red hot crack. And it's all about the repetitions and getting in the water and, and, and getting through the work. Um, but when it comes to, you know, competing and training in a certain, I guess, location. So say you move from Collaroy Surf Life Saving Club up to Malulaba. Um, how does that, you know, affect your training? I guess if you've got a, an environment where the swell is often bigger, there's more rips and currents and you really have to, ch the, the ocean is challenging you a lot more. Um, in a competitive environment, that's only going to improve your prospects of winning and your performance. So how did that, obviously the training was a lot harder and you had a better coaching team and, you know, the people around you, you know, pushed you to excel, but how did that environment also challenge you? I guess the, the conditions of the ocean specifically. Yeah. So Malula bar, if you're familiar with it, there's not many waves there. <laughs> so it was very, it was, it was quite flat most days. Um, but you know, on the, on the flip side, we were very, very fit. Um, we'd either, so we'd mix up our training from being at Malula bar or to, Kawana, One Beach South or down to Maruchidor um, where they're renowned for more, you know, I guess, bigger surf, ribs, currents, all that sort of stuff. And if you can juggle both of those, I guess, locations in terms of getting yourself fit and then getting skills, um, mate, that's, that's ideal. Um, but I guess from a young age prior to going um, up to Malulaba, <clears throat> being at Collaroy, um, you know, some of the guys that I used to train with at Collaroy, they're some of the best um, skilled surf ski paddlers, board paddlers, you know, that I'd ever seen. Um, and Collaroy isn't renowned, renowned for having big waves, but, you know, we train at South Narrabeen and other locations which which have big surf. So I was always big on, hey, let's get the skills done first. Let's get them under your belt and then you, anyone can get fit. 